Is Quebec City really Canada's ultimate Christmas destination? We're about to find out. I'm Yasmin, and I invite you to join my family and I as we stroll through the charming cobblestone streets of Quebec City's historic Petit Champlain district, immerse ourselves in the classic elegance of the world's most photographed hotel, and savor bite-sized moments from North America's unique French-Canadian culture. So, Mom, how does this German Christmas market compare to the ones in Germany? Well, we chose the iconic Fermont Le Chateau Fontenac as our holiday base due to its fairy tale setting, reputation for great service, and central location in the heart of the fortified old city, the only walled city in Canada. Perched on a cliff overlooking Fleuve Saint Laurent, the Regal Hotel holds a rich history dating back to its opening in 1893. It is one of the grand hotels commissioned by the Canadian Pacific Railway to promote luxury train travel and has since hosted countless dignitaries, royalty, and celebrities. Ah! Bonjour, bonjour. <laughs> Due to our hectic December schedules, we decided to visit Quebec at the end of November when the Old Town transforms into an enchanting Christmas village. We booked our accommodation a year in advance as we've learned that reserving early doesn't necessarily mean paying early, and you often get better deals when you book well in advance. With three generations traveling together on this trip, the Christmas wish was to have a comfortable space for family pajama nights. One of our rooms is this lovely Fairmont room with a view of the courtyard. Oh, the snow is falling. And for the second room, we'll be enjoying a spacious suite with a view onto the river. Oh, what is this? Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is like a whole house. <laughs> it's like a whole house. What is this, a bathroom? Yeah. Wait, let's see. Oh, oh. Another bathroom, bathtub for oh, what is this? Yeah, bathtub in here. Oh, this is for me. <laughs> Ooh. Unbelievable, huh? This is all like a perfect dream. Ah! Tree. So, what do you think? Fantastic. <laughs> Here's the plan. We are going to take a walk in the old town while it's still light outside. Then we'll head back to the hotel to experience all the wonderful activities available to hotel guests. We'll eat and then we will visit the German Christmas market when the lights are at their brightest. French explorer Samuel de Champlain established a permanent European settlement on the site of present-day Vieux-Québec in 1608. Evolving from a bustling fur trading centre to the capital of New France by 1663, the lower town by the river became a hub for merchants, while the upper town, protected by steep cliffs, was the location of the governor's residence. With French as the official language and an architectural heritage that reflects Quebec's French and British colonial history, Vieux Quebec may make you feel like you've just stepped into Europe. Back at the hotel, we decided to participate in some of the exclusive activities offered to hotel guests. We were keen to try the wine and mixology workshops, but they were fully booked, so we took a chance and waited on standby lists. Luck was on our side, and we had an enjoyable time tasting unique beverages and learning tips of the trade from a very engaging group of professionals. With spirits high and bellies rumbling, it was time to eat. The initial plan was to grab a casual bite at one of the food stalls at the market, or enjoy a traditional French dish at a nearby restaurant but there's something very alluring about the old world glamour of the hotel. It comforts you like a warm and silky cashmere blanket. The cozy vibe of Bistro La Sam was the perfect setting to refuel before heading out for a night on the town. Oh, wow. That is beautiful. Have a nice day. Thank you. This is spectacular. We're heading off to the Christmas market. I am dressed like a gnome. <laughs> Thank you, Mom, for pointing that out. 
Le Marché de Noël Allemand is open Thursday to Sunday starting from late November to December 23rd. It's a free event that's spread over five locations in the heart of the Old Town and includes gift and food kiosks, live entertainment for all ages, and a wonderfully festive atmosphere. I am so excited! I literally feel like I'm five years old whenever I come to a Christmas market. <laughs> well, I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the wishes. And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. It took me less than 10 minutes to buy something already. <laughs> but I needed it. What do we have over here? I still haven't seen my beloved Christmas houses. Oh, do you smell the apple cinnamon donuts? Take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose. Moving nimbly. Did you hear something from the chimney? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. So, Mom, how does this German Christmas market compare to the ones in Germany? Well, it is almost the same, not as large as in Germany, but otherwise it's the best solution if you don't want to leave the country. Okay, if you don't want to leave Canada. You go there and you have the nice architecture and the markets are wonderful. The people are fantastic. The food is great. Would you say this is Canada's ultimate Christmas destination? It's absolutely wonderful to have a holiday there with your children. Oh, everyone's pushing, not at the same time. <laughs> oh my gosh. You look like you're sitting in a glass of eggnog. It's pretty darn cute. Well, Feliz Navidad, Joyeux Noël, and Merry Christmas! <laughs>